Vicente Luque takes on the legend, Nick Diaz. Nick Diaz is back. The one and only Nick Diaz. Nick Diaz making his return. Will this be the final time? We don't know. Nick Diaz, a man that made his UFC debut 21 years ago at UFC 44 against Jeremy Jackson. He beat him by an armbar. Then he knocked out Robbie Lawler. You must have seen that one. That is a knockout that does the rounds all the time. A legendary knockout over Robbie Lawler. And then he went on to have a legendary career. Of course, Nick Diaz, as we know, he's no spring chicken. He's been around the fight game forever. And he's a legend. I love everything about him. I love his style. I love his attitude. Last time we saw him was against the aforementioned Robbie Lawler, and it didn't go too well for him. He turned up, they had to move the fight to 185. He wasn't in the best shape, didn't look too good, and he got stopped in the third round. But what I've seen of Nick Diaz recently online, the man is taking this very, very seriously. He looks to be in phenomenal shape. He's ripped. Last time at UFC 266, he showed up. He looked a bit chubby. He looked a bit out of shape. And the kind of performance reflected that as well. Well, not right now. This version of Nick Diaz is ready. He's in shape and he's angry. He's pissed off. He wants to show the world who he is. And who he is is a 41-year-old man, okay? But the man's got attitude. The man's a fighter. That will always be a part of his DNA and it will never go away. Beautiful boxing, great jiu-jitsu, and just the attitude, the fighting spirit that the man has Going up against Vincente Luque, that is unbelievable. 